get some light up in here. What's going on, everybody? You got the Raging Rob here. A lot of shit's going down. Breaking news. Lewiston, Maine. We got another mass shooting. Now the gun control idiots are going to come out tomorrow. Just, just so you know. So we have, you know, they like the, for some reason, the number 22 keeps showing up. Uh, a lot of dates of these mass shootings. I've seen November 22nd. I've seen June 22nd. July 22nd, 22 dead out in El Paso, Texas. The Walmart, you remember a few years ago in El Paso? I actually been to that Walmart when I was uh, traveling, I think it was last year. I went out to Phoenix for about a month and I stopped in El Paso for a minute and I actually went inside that Walmart. I had to, I had to get something. Uh... There was another shooting, 22 dead, somewhere. I can't remember where it was. So, yeah. The number 22 keeps popping up. And now we have 22 dead, allegedly, in Lewiston, Maine. Which, not much goes on in Maine. Maine is a constitutional carry state. I don't even remember the last time they had a mass shooting in the Northeast. It just doesn't happen up there. I got a couple friends up there. But anyway, I'll send my condolences and thoughts and prayers to the people involved. I know the Democrats have a hard time understanding that. Fuck your thoughts and prayers, they like to say. And that's a problem right there. You take God out of things. And then we have this. As far as I'm concerned, the suspect has been identified as 32-year-old Robert Card. He had a Twitter account that was suspended. X, I should say. X. You know, it's not Twitter anymore. X. Degeneration. X. Anyway. He was allegedly in the Army. And he had mental health issues. He was not supposed to be in the possession of a firearm anyway. He was a registered sex offender. He was not supposed to be in possession of a firearm. Like I said, criminals don't follow laws. How did he get the weapon? I don't know. And they didn't say what kind of weapon was used. I mean, there's pictures of him what looked like an AR-15, but nobody said AR-15 in, in the news reports that I've seen. So, but the gun control idiots are going to come out. <clears throat> The gun control idiots are going to come out. Um, I'm not going to go on details, but I'm leaving state soon. I'm leaving Michigan in a bit. I'm not going to say when. Things are happening here in Michigan. That's all I'm going to say, and I'm leaving this fucking state. I'm leaving the fucking state for a while. So I'm not going into details, but that's that. So... That's what's going on in Maine. Horrific situation going on. I don't even know if they caught the guy yet. There's reports that he got on a boat somewhere in a river. And he could be anywhere. <clears throat> so. Lewiston, Maine. It's the second biggest city in Maine. I, I've been up to Maine. There's not much in Maine. It's not... I don't even think they have a city with 100,000 people. I think Portland's the biggest city. And Lewiston, they said Lewiston's number two. And that's only 33,000 people. Hey, there's the number 33 again. For Pablo on Twitter. Pablo 33. There's your 33. Anyway. The guy on Twitter, he's always obsessed with 33. 30, 336 pounds, he says. Pablo on Twitter. X, I should say. Okay. 
so yeah, very horrific situation in uh, in Maine. You know, I'm just gonna say this right up. I believe in if you see something, you should say something. I, I'm I'm serious. I know some people have a hard time comprehending that. For people that know Raging Rob in Michigan, there's some people out there, I'm not gonna say any names, but there's some people out there that have a hard time with, uh, you know, doing the right thing. And when you see something, you say something. Some people have a hard time comprehending that. But just be glad. That, well, I'm not going to go too much into details, but just be glad that some people do care about what happens in the world. And certain things get stopped from happening to prevent incidents like what we have in Maine. I'll just post it. I'll just post that. I'll just say that. I'm not going to go in details, but that's that. So, oh, we got some good news. We got a new house speaker. Finally, after two weeks, we finally got a fucking speaker of the house. Mike Johnson. It's not Jim Jordan. I'm not a huge fan of Jim Jordan. I'm not a fan of anybody that voted for McCarthy. That includes Marjorie Taylor Greene. I love Marjorie Taylor Greene, but you voted for McCarthy. I, honestly, I didn't want Jim Jordan. But Mike Johnson, he's good. He tried to decertify the 2020 election. He's for babies' rights. He's for a lot of good things. He's a Christian. And a lot of the left is losing their shit. The Democrats are losing, they're, they're biting their nails now. I'm not a fan, I'm not huge on MAGA, but I'd rather have Mike Johnson in there than Jeffries. I mean, Mitt Romney, he would have voted for fucking Jeffries if he was in the House. He's in the Senate. But we got a new speaker. We can finally get shit going. We can finally get the investigations going. We can finally get Joe Biden and Kamala Harris impeached. We can finally get some shit done. This is what we need. But Johnson is the man. Johnson is the man. Let's get it done. Anyway, this is Raging Rob. And to uh, the fake triots in Michigan, they got a problem with me? I'm not going anywhere. Let that be fucking be known. I'm not going anywhere. I want to let that known to some people in Michigan. They have a problem with my fucking face. Raging Rob is not going anywhere. If you got something to say to me, you can come say it to my face. That's all I got to say about that. I'm out.